I'm so sorry for publishing this tutorial only now. I have had such a busy, crazy week, I couldn't find the time for beading. And I am so glad now because I can play and relax myself with beads uh, that it's like breathing to me. Anyway, let's start the tutorial and to create this chenille rope you will need side stand John James needles, bead weaving thread, size 8 seed beads and two colors of size 11 seed beads. Pick up one size 8 seed bead and fix it at the end of the thread with a knot as a stopping bead. Pick up one size 11 seed bead, one size 8 and repeat this sequence until you have on your needle four size 11 beads and three size 8 beads. Then bring all the beads to the end of the thread. Sew through the stopping bead and all the next beads to close the working around. To start this first round, go outside from a size 8 seed bead. Then pick up one size 11 seed bead and sew through the next size 11 bead and size 8. Repeat the same step three more times until the end of the round. Here we are, the first round is completed. To start the second round, be sure to go outside from a turquoise bead. Then pick up one size 8 and one size 11 and sew through the next turquoise bead. Repeat this step three more times until the end of the round. Even the second round is completed. To be ready to start the third one, go outside from a size 8 bead as we did at the first round and repeat the same steps we did before for the first round using the turquoise beads. When the third round will be completed, go outside from a turquoise bead and repeat the steps we did before on the second round. It's really very easy, you have to alternate the rounds. So, go on like this until you reach the length you need for your spiral. And when your spiral is completed, before tying off the thread, sew through the beads several times until you feel that the thread is really fixed on the beadwork. This shiny spiral can become a bracelet or a necklace. You can put at the end of the rope some beaded end caps. And I made a tutorial about beaded end caps long ago. I will leave you the link in the information box under the video. Otherwise, you can turn the chenille spiral into a bracelet using simply some nylon coated wire and crimps as we have seen in the previous tutorial. I hope that the tutorial was clear. Thank you for watching and keep on beating. Bye bye!